Hi guys, Dan Stollers here. Here we go then. Is there going to be a winner today or are we moving on to day number five? Has anybody guessed how many coins are in Dan's box? And the answer to that question is... No, they haven't, but we've had someone one or two away. I can't tell you exactly, otherwise when you see the list, you'll know which or which ones it might not be. I have scribbled a few of them out as well, just to try and get it a little bit easier for you. And as you can see, we are down to just a select number. And I really honestly can't believe that it hasn't been guessed yet. So if you haven't played along before, all you need to do is start your comment in the comment section below with how many coins you think there are in my box. As you can see now, the list on the screens from 303 all the way to 417. The numbers that are crossed out, they're ones that have been guessed incorrectly. The ones that are still there with no line through them, Definitely try and guess them ones. It is one of those on the screen. The highest it could possibly be is 414 and the lowest it could be, and I'm going to make it a little bit easier. I'm going to scribble a couple more out for you. The lowest it could be is going to be 349. So that means there isn't any of them lower than that. I'll scribble the ones out that it definitely isn't just to try and make it a little bit easier at home. So we're definitely going to get a winner. If nobody does guess it correctly, which I'm more than sure they will, the closest person will win two coins out of UK circulation of their choice. And there's also going to be a second place prize as well. Unfortunately, the Q Gardens 50p isn't up for grabs, but it is up for grabs in the monthly giveaway. So definitely do check that out. So get your family in the room, get a guessing together. Let's get this one tomorrow with someone guessing the correct number. Have a lovely night, guys. Not long left for the top commenter of the week. Huge shout out to everyone that scored points so far. And as always, thanks for watching.